so I'll just take so you can, one. You sure? You can one take for the office. Yeah. I yeah. Think. You can keep all of them no matter what. You can do well, it's going to be a waste if you could give them to someone. That would be nice. Okay. If I post one here. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you good luck. Bye. Okay, bye. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to have uh, arrangements made for the uh, assembly at 2.30. Can you okay. say a few words here? My problem is, is I have a meeting with the whole bunch of citizens over at Tax Issue at 2.30. Oh, okay. So I can, I'm just going to say a few words here. Okay, perfect. And after that I'm going to have to head out because I have a bunch of people waiting at the other end. Okay, perfect. So I just wanted to show yeah. up for the march. And, uh, Thank you. Okay. Thank cool. you for coming. I figured more important than March to get to Mr. Uh, what's his name? Peter. Okay. If you say precious consent, People will listen. Okay, I hear you. But he's actually, Peter's brought that over. And he's had the, uh, he's had, can we have one of those for the yeah, office? Yeah, absolutely. Actually, if you give me two of them, I'll put them in both okay. offices. Now, Smitherman is open to this. Good. The other government wasn't. Yeah. So yeah. we're hoping that, uh, yeah. you know, with the NDP's help, yeah. sure. that we can help make the needed changes. Very good. Very good. All righty. Okay, I've got to get go. Uh, yep. There you is. I have to go off to, I've got to go off to another meeting, but I just wanted to congratulate you for the work that you do. It tells me something, and you know, often we adults talk about how kids don't have heart, and they don't care, and they're not socially active. That's all garbage. We know that you guys care, that you do what has to be done, and this is proof of it. This is a very serious issue. I think uh, from time to time in our families and friends, we see people that are in need of organ transplant. In fact, I was on a plane Sunday flying down to Toronto when a person from Timmins told me he got a call after waiting six years for a kidney transplant and he just, you know, within 15 minutes had to run to the airport, jump on a plane uh, to go for a transplant. It's pretty serious stuff. The work that you're doing, Chris, is good because it raises the issue so that people start thinking about it. And as I was talking to your dad and some others that are involved with you, we're working at Queen's Park and trying to 
develop legislation that makes it much easier for being able to find people that are prepared to make sure that their organs are given in the event that something should happen to them so that other people can have a chance to live or to have a better health. So I wish you well. We'll continue working on this. And I know with the support of your friends, your amis, as we say in campus casing, uh, that you'll do well. So I hope uh, everything goes well with you. And it yes, tells sir. me, uh, sir, you have a very fine Sunday. You should be proud. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Any quick questions before I run and see if uh, all your parents are mad about property tax assessment? <laughs> Good luck. Okay. Thank you. I'm sorry? You said about that movie for this? Yeah. <laughs> Can I have your attention, please? Please. Yes. Okay, this is a quote from uh, Christopher Knowles. My wish is to accomplish a 200 city slash town walking tour across Canada. I want to bring attention to the issue so I can help save nearly 4,000 4, Canadians that also need organ transplants. Can we have a please uh, round of applause for uh, Christopher? Okay, this is a little bit different uh, how we, than we usually do it, uh, but uh, my name is George Machola, I'm the road manager. Uh, what, what we're going to do is uh, get uh, Chris to say a few words. Uh, so, yeah, where's your book? Books. Uh, Then right after we do your few words, we'll get quickly into the uh, questions and answers, okay? This guy needs time to shoot. Okay, so here's Chris. Dressed up in a dress, one of the. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, no kidding. Uh, <laughs> he, he dressed up in a dress just to meet Chris. Like, you know, you know, so we got the photo and everything. So, you know, and it's going up on our website under Campus Casey. So, uh, and uh, who else? Uh, do we have any other people that? Uh, we did, this town has just been so great with support. Uh, now tomorrow, we're going to be doing a big fundraiser uh, while we're here. We're going to uh, uh, be at the Circle, 